everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel and happen to stumble by, I'm your girl Bella and I would totally love if you join me on my YouTube adventures. Hello, hello everybody and welcome back. Hi guys, happy Monday, happy Monday, happy Monday. This is, saw the title of the video, this is the official 2021 Christmas home tour. Finally done. Everything's in its place and it's all done and I'm very excited to bring this to you. So every year I go all out for Christmas. I go all out for Christmas and I think to myself, I want my house to feel over the top. I want it to be over the top. I want it to have all the Christmas feels, the smells, the, the, the sentiment of Christmas, what the reason for Christmas is and everything. And this year I struggled. I struggled. I did struggle. I have moved to a brand new state, brand new country for that matter, and a brand new state, the polar opposites. I was up north in Canada and now I'm here in Southwest Florida. So it was a little bit difficult because of the weather to get accustomed to doing, um, to be really in the holiday spirit. But I think I achieved it. I think I achieved it. And, um, and I have a message for you all for Christmas also, obviously. So as you watch the video, I will be uh, sharing along uh, some decor that I did and why I did it and the reason for it. And also my Christmas message to you. And um, yeah, so enjoy the video. And I will see you right at the end. Hi everybody, welcome to my official 2021 Christmas home tour. I want to welcome you all into my home this year. I have tried my best to get the holiday spirit in this house. And um, I really want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for coming along on this crazy adventure. What an adventure this year was. I know the last couple of years have been very, very taxing to us all, but Christmas is all about believing. Believing in the magic of Christmas, believing that tomorrow is gonna be a better day, believing that things will just become fabulous and wonderful, having faith and believing. And that is the true meaning of Christmas because the true meaning of Christmas is for our Savior, Jesus. You know, He came to earth to forgive us for all our sins and make our lives so much better. Okay, let's get into the nitty gritty. So this year, I wanted to have a winter wonderland feel because I thought... Maybe I'll miss the snow. I do not miss the snow at all. <laughs> and But I did want a cozy winter wonderland feeling. And I think I achieved it. I do think I achieved it. This year, unlike other years, I did not purchase a lot of stuff. Yes, Somerville, I still miss you. <laughs> I love Christmas, guys. I love Christmas. I love everything about Christmas. And um, I just think it's so magical and so amazing. For all of you that know, this whole setup hides a patio door. Yes, it does. This video gives you lots of inspiration and that really good 
feeling, that real good feeling of Christmas, and it makes you all festive and gets you in the mood for something Christmassy to do with your friends and a family. And if you haven't decorated, you still got time. I really, really do like how the tree turned out this year. I mean, I was itching to put red in it, but we'll have to wait till next year. Next year, I'm going to do a whole different theme. Okay, let's move on. My dining room. <laughs> well, let's take a final look at the beautiful fireplace. But my dining room this year, oh my goodness. I got this little tree. My dining room set is very, very traditional. And I, you know what? Instead of fighting it, I embrace it. I got all the plaids out. I was going to go buy more napkins. I'll probably set the table up for Christmas Day. I love how I decorated the top of my hutch. I really like that I've corralled my ginger jars up there with the garland. I do think it looks very beautiful. And yes, that is a large charcuterie board from my store if you're interested. And here's my little Santa tree with all the plaids and reds and golds and greens and the Santas that I have collected throughout uh, the last couple years. And there's another look from the dining room looking into the living room. I just think it looks so good. And I do feel very blessed. I do feel very blessed to have this home. Okay, guys. Time to leave the living room and go to the fun part of the house. You know, where Mrs. Claus is all the time. All right. I have to admit, this is my favorite part of the house. I love it. I love it. Christmas, you need red. I don't know what I was thinking with that neutral living room, but Christmas, you need red. This is where Mrs. Claus resides, yes. I have this little cute bar, bar top area, and I just set it up for a place setting of two. Guys, those are the dollar store plates, Dollar Tree plates. Really cute. Told you they'd look good. Yes, I go over the top in the kitchen. I go over the top in the kitchen. I love it. Why not? It's Christmas. It's Jesus' birthday. Let's go overboard. <laughs> but you saw that I ran out of steam. I was going to put bows on those trees up there and all kinds of things. But guys, I just ran out of steam. I love incorporating this Mackenzie Child stuff and the ba uh, Better Homes and Garden collection that I have from um, Walmart really, really does tie in together really nicely. And like I said, when I was decorating the kitchen, I don't like a lot of clutter. I just don't like a lot of clutter in a kitchen. But I do like stuff. <laughs> so as you can tell, I do like stuff. And this is my view when I wash dishes. I love it. It's so cozy. It's so, so cozy. All right, let's go to the fun part. I love this tree. I love my peppermint gingerbread tree. But before we go there, here, let's get a little drink at my little bar station. Guys, this is so cute. I'm telling you, make yourself a little bar area. Especially if you're having people over for a cocktail or something. I got the cutest cocktail towels. They are adorable. 
and all the things you need for your bar, stir sticks, glasses, and Mr. and Mrs. Claus ready to kiss. You know what? I know I'm still going to do a little bit more Vlogmas. So I'm going to show you guys a really cute cocktail. Okay, my favorite part. My Mrs. Claus's kitchen area where people gather and eat. And there's all the fun stuff. Yes, all the fun stuff. Even the little elves came to play in the hot cocoa bar station. I love this this year. I love it. Guys, this collection has been going on for a long time now, and I just collect things over the years, things that I love. I only buy things that I love, truly. Sorry about the lighting, but it was daytime. And wait, because I have clips of nighttime, and it look, the house looks really magical at night, and that's coming up soon. So the peppermint tree, I love this tree. I love it, full of cupcakes and peppermints and gingerbreads and everything, I love it. And can you believe it? I haven't even done my chalkboard yet. And there's my coffee station. I love that station. Every morning makes me happy. And here's the little two-tiered tray. Guys, this is from my shop also. So all the orders have gone out for Christmas, and we have not received any new orders. So if you're looking for your order, it's already gone out. And there's once over of the kitchen. I hope you guys are enjoying this tour. I really, really enjoy making these kinds of videos for you guys. And especially decorating. Because this is my thing to do. And there's the once over of the house. And my glorious tree. I love the tree. On a cold winter night, there is nothing better than putting on all your Christmas lights, sitting by a fire, and watching a Hallmark movie, or enjoying special memories with your friends and family. Making memories with our families is the most important thing. Our children are so important. Our families are so important. I'm truly missing all my family this year. It's very different, very different, but I feel very, very, very thankful and very blessed that the good Lord granted me my dream come true. I prayed for this for many, many years, many years to be back in the South, to be in a warm climate, and he granted me my wish. So whatever you wish in your heart, please believe that it will happen. It can happen and it will happen. And so many more things I have in my heart that I am praying the good Lord will grant me. So this Christmas season, no matter what you do, try and believe, try and believe, have faith. Your faith is what will get you through anything in this world.
I'm going to say it again. I would like to thank every single one of my subbies for commentating, for sending me beautiful comments, for all the love and support that you've shown me throughout these years. I want to wish you all the most merriest of merriest Christmas. Please have a cup of cheer on me. Please remember that there is someone out there that loves you all very, very much. Please remember that, you know, I couldn't do this if it wasn't for you all. So thank you again from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. What do you think? Did you like it? <laughs> Did you like it? It's the home is not as big as my other homes have been. And um, it is Monday. It is Monday and you made it to the end of the video. So you're probably thinking, Bella, what are we doing? It's Monday, y'all. Let's do it. Let's declare, declare, declare in his name, in his name, that whatever we want, whatever we desire in our hearts, be it an illness to go away, be it our finances to get better, be it an unspoken prayer, be it that our relationships get better, declare, declare, declare in his name that it will come to fruition. God is good. God always gives you what you need when you need it. He doesn't give you what you want, but he always gives you what you need. And I truly believe that. So declare, declare, declare. And as for me and Christmas, I want to wish you all again the most beautiful, magical Christmas ever. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for sticking with me, for following along on my adventures, for giving me all the love and support and sharing and commenting and, and all the love that I give out to you reciprocate to me. So I just want to wish you all a very, very Merry Christmas. And I will see you very soon, probably tomorrow. I love you guys. Have a fantastic week. Have a fantastic day ahead. And again, Merry Christmas. And I hope you subscribe. <laughs> Bye, YouTube. Bye, everybody. Love you guys.